Hello, everybody. It's Sandra and her mom. Hi. And uh, what do we need to know? Well, we only accept PayPal at this time. You need to reach out to us. The email is I am the funky pickle at gmail.com. Shipping in the U.S. is $5 no matter how many pieces you buy. International will be more. And I think that is all we got. So let's get started. We're going to start today with two um, really collectible Leah Stein pieces. These are vintage. I got these from a, a kind of a serious jewelry collector who bought these. Um, she said that she bought some in Paris and some in England. So we'll start out with this. This is the Fabulous Fox. And there's the Leah Stein. This is beautiful. I really like this orange because I don't think it's too much in your face. You know, it's just sort of a neutral orange. I love the texture in there. Vintage Leah Stein brooch. By the way, I also just want to mention something really quickly. You know, there's no pressure to buy any of this stuff. I wouldn't want anybody to feel like, you know, I mean, you know, I'm sure everybody knows that, but I just, I just want to throw that out there. Uh, any of the stuff that doesn't sell, I'll put it on my eBay page. I'll keep it. I'll sell it in an auction or whatever. So just an FYI on that. Okay. And if you're just here to watch and have fun, welcome. That's perfectly fine. So here's another Leah Stein item. This is also a book piece. I don't think I mentioned that. Of course, the foxes, those are also book pieces. But um, he's fantastic. I love this faux kind of tortoiseshell look. There is the signature, Leah Stein Paris. What a cute, <laughs> really, really cute dog. This is $120. He's handsome. He is very handsome. <laughs> he looks like so animated, like he'd be panting and <laughs> yeah. hop on your lap. He's a friendly one. I bought these pins um, a long time ago in the 80s at a Beatles convention, and they're pretty cool. And if you have a Beatles collector or you are a Beatles collector, or maybe you just, you know, your husband is or whatever, this is very cool. These are guaranteed to be original. They're from 1964. They are uh, officially licensed, NEMS. These are pretty awesome. And I would sell this whole set on the card. You can see the kind of condition, really great condition. The card's in nice shape, too. I would uh, be able to do these for $18 for all four. Look at this beautiful pair of earrings. Don't you love these, Mom? I think they're very pretty, Sandy. Yeah, these are, these are gorgeous. So they're not silver. Really surprising. They're silver plated. I mean, they're just so sort of little. I don't know why they wouldn't just make them silver, but they're they're not. These are beautiful. I don't think these have been worn. I got these at an estate sale. I got these at the estate sale where I got a lot of the J. King jewelry. Anyway, these beautiful little things are twelve dollars. Those are very sweet. These are dogwood flowers, right, Mom? It looks like it is. But they could be about anything, Sandy, but they do look like dogwood. You're good. They're beautiful. Love those. And of course, these come in the box. I don't know who that is, CBC. Um, not sure. But anyway, these will come in the box too. Why don't we sell some stuff from the jewelry jars I've been getting? This is just a super fun, super colorful, fabulous, I think, pink necklace. This is just acrylic, you know, whatever, plastic, whatever kind it is. It's nice and big. We can measure it in a minute. I didn't see a signature or anything, but I think this is really fun. Let me just try to pull the camera back. Yeah, this is awesome, I think. All right, let me just um, measure it real quick. This has about a 10-inch drop. Just a really, really cute item. It's $14. Here's an item from a recent jewelry jar. What a pretty orchid this is. Mm. I love this necklace. It's so um, lightweight. I think it's a very beautiful cream color. It is. And you can see the flowers continue up the sides here. So this is really light. There's a little bit of discoloration, you know, here. See, kind of on the on the metal. I mean, it wouldn't really show when you're wearing it, certainly. And what is the drop on this one, Mom? 11 inches. 11 inches. Okay, 11 inch drop or so. That's a sweet necklace. Here's what I love about this necklace. It really looks like it's stone, but it isn't. These are just plastic discs. I don't think this is particularly old or anything. I just think this is a neat piece. It's I just, a nine inch. I love, okay, this one has a nine inch drop. Mm -hmm. 
and here's what our hardware looks like back here. I think this one's really, I don't know, I just really like it. It's in great condition. This one's $12. This necklace is by Coldwater Creek. It says so on the hang tag. We'll take a look at this. I look at that, the hang tag. This is really super cool plastic moon glow beads. And we'll see what it says. Coldwater Creek, right there. This is a great statement piece. This would look amazing, it, you know, at night in the lights or the candlelight or also in the sunshine. I think that's a really, really neat piece. This one is $15. What's the drop on it, Mom? Um, Coldwater Creek, um, 11 inches. 11 inch drop. But you see there is adjustability back here, right? You could kind of hook it up to any of these links. So it could go uh, shorter than that if you wish. Okay, let's move on. This was one of the best ones from the jar from the other day. <clears throat> I love this. This is the one I was saying has kind of an Egyptian feel. I didn't realize this before, but this is actually signed. And I think somebody told me this is not Liz Claiborne. That's Laura Conrad. If, the, if that even is an Elsie. Yeah, it is. Well, it doesn't matter what it is. It's lovely. This is a lovely thing. It's $15. And let me just uh, hook this on here so we can show it off on the on the neck. It's pretty. I love this. Yes. I really, really oh, love I this. Too. That's lovely. And so we won't do the drop on this. We'll just do the the length. What is it, Mom? Is a seventeen inches. Yeah, and, and all the measurements are approximate. You know, it's seventeen inches. You know, ish. This one's in nice condition. Nice and light. You know, plastic. Um. Those are probably wood, those little things. And yeah, this part's metal, of course. That's a good one. This is another estate sale find. Wait till you see this one, Mom. You'll remember this. We were together when we bought this. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. So this is very incredibly yes. I know. beautiful hand-carved coral. This is a beautiful and necklace. It's a soft coral. It is a very soft color. It's not yes. It's That's not right. Bright. And it it's 14 karat gold finding. So how about that? Lovely. Let me um let me just see if there's a mark also. It is marked 14K GSJ. So we can look up who that is. And it also comes with these matching earrings. And these are also, look, 14 karat gold and carved coral. And, you know, that's not just a tiny, tiny little piece of gold either. Let's put this on our neck. This is beautiful. That is truly, yes, truly is. beautiful. Yes. And you're also going to get the earrings. So I would be able to do $130 on the carved coral 14 karat gold set. And let me measure the necklace for you. The necklace is about 18 inches long and we're going to, you know, include, well, it came with these two plastic bags and also this black velvet box. This was likely a QVC item. That's one of the best things, I think. Right, Mom? It's beautiful. It's incredible. Yes. So let's have a look at some metal flower power pins. First of all, we have this one. This one's really nice. I like the the double layer of petals and this one's in excellent condition too and i really you know always love this neutral a neutral color like that too so um these are all going to be 12 dollars. okay so we have this one at 12. this is fab this red white and blue one you have a little bit of normal wear i don't see anything too heinous <laughs> or anything so 12 for that one. And this one is awesome. This one's really a bright color. A real day glow, orange, uh, just a, a little tiny bit of wear here and there. Maybe we'll just do, we'll do 10 on this one, okay? Um, this daisy is awesome, but why don't we do eight? <laughs> okay, that's not what she said originally. Yeah, I'm just kind of changing it up here. This has like just a little bit of wear. Nothing bad, right? Nothing bad. So anybody who likes flower power pins, these rock. 
I know lots of people love cameos. I love this. I love her expression. I love the flowers in her hair. She's How beautiful. incredibly beautiful is this? Lovely. So this is, you know, two separate pieces. This is not carved from, from one piece, I don't think, you know, the way they usually are. But this one is beautiful. It's $38 on this. I would do 35 on this. This is actually 800 silver. It's marked right there, but there's, you know, some a gold wash on it. That's it's kind of coming off just just a bit, not not too bad. But this can be worn as a pendant too or a pin. Oh, look at the hair. Look at the detailing. She's beautiful. I love her. Here's another cameo. This one's probably from the 1920s really pretty shell look at her little flower on her on her dress right there i love her dress too like the material there's the mark so this needs its little well it's a little bit crooked right there i just want to mention that too uh this is a pendant you know and it needs the little jump ring thing put on that's beautiful 35 dollars on this one this necklace is a recent jewelry jar item i love it i love this yes look at the yes. pearls how sort of irregular they are and i yes. love the colors so this is sterling silver and um what's the measurement mom 18 16 to 18 6 to 18 right because there's some adjustability so we mm -hmm. will take a look at that this is beautiful oh man i love it look at that really pretty abalone shell this looks like kind of nice weight too you know it's just not a little light thing but you can see there, there's where the adjustability is. Isn't that nice? So yeah. this uh, beautiful sterling silver pearl and abalone, this is $38. I'm going to sell my antique purse. <laughs> this is incredible. It holds, holds a lot. Yeah, it holds, <laughs> it holds a lot. Holds it actually could hold, yeah, it holds my <laughs> savings too. That's yeah, very funny, mom. This one, uh, this technique is a Shamla V, I think that's how it's pronounced. This is a nice condition other than the handle part. So the handle part has got an issue, you know, like this part broke off and then somebody just sort of twisted this all up. I believe this could be safely worn as a pendant, you know, just as it oh, is, because be I don't think this would go anywhere. Uh, you could also hang it from a pin or, um, you know, it, but, but somebody might have the know-how how to fix this anyway it's 30 dollars if anybody wants it it's just lovely 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 with those butterflies yes it is that's truly a it's like a little work of art isn't it mom yes mom i figured we could try selling a little bit of gold if people want it this is going to you know really be priced right it's so beautiful and that this is incredible is lacy looking. it is lacy looking so this is 14 karat gold this is humongous mm. yes it's 14 karat gold it kind of seems like i mean i don't really know but it seems like there you know a jeweler made this bigger at some point you, just, you can kind of see some little lines on the inside um but here's here's the thing i want to point out it's not like you would ever notice this but see like like right there there's like a little break and right there there's a little break it really wouldn't be noticeable now these are real opals i just i love i love this and it's really really big so i know ladies of a certain age you know you start to get arthritic and so on so if anybody is a size 12 whoa if anybody is a size 12 well, i bet a lot of people are yes definitely well, actually, maybe it's even a little bit bigger than a 12. Um, well, it's a lovely thing in any event. Opal, 14 karat gold. I think it's beautiful. beautiful. It's it's too. much too big on me, but I'll just sort of model it for you. It's beautiful. Isn't that pretty? Looks like a flower. It's incredible. So yeah. I would I would be able to sell this for $80 if anybody's interested. It's really well worth it. Here is a really sweet, tiny little 14 karat gold M pendant or a charm. There's the mark right there. This one is uh, $38.
which is a great price, I think. For 14 karat gold, here is a 14 karat gold cat. That's cute. This is adorable. I love the way the nose and the eyes are cut out, you know, so whatever color blouse, yeah. you know, it would show through. Mm -hmm. That's really sweet. So let's take a look at the mark. It says 14 karat uh, MA, which is Michael Anthony, and it looks like it's from 1987. So that wasn't, uh, you know, not, I mean, it's vintage E, it, vintage ish. <laughs> is that a word? Anyway, uh, this one is $42. It's a charm. It's a charm or a pendant. And here's a little 14 karat gold rose. Isn't that pretty? This one is also marked 14 karat. It's kind of hard to read, but it is right there on the bale. And of course, these have all been tested. So this one is $32, 14 karat gold, little pendant or a charm. Look at this cute giraffe pin. Ain't he cute? Look at his eye. This is $11. A really sweet item. This came out of a jewelry jar too recently. That's very fun. Looks like it's all hand painted. I love his blue eye though. Here's a very beautiful necklace. I love this necklace. This is a Brighton. Take a look at that. There it is, that little heart right there. This is nice and heavy. I'm going to put it on my neck so we can get a better look at, at what it would look like. Though there is some adjustability to this. That's really sweet, the isn't it? It's always so impressive. Yeah, I love Brighton too. Yeah, yeah. It's really nice. And there's a nice collector's market for it, you know? So it's kind of cool. I mean, if you're a reseller too, you know, you could wear it for a while and then uh, get your money back. This one is um, $16. And what does it measure, Mom? What did I just say? 16 to 19. It's like 16 to 19 inches. You see, it's like adjustable right there. Here's another item from a jewelry jar. Um, no, no, this one wasn't from a jewelry jar. I take that back. This was uh, bought separately. This is beautiful. Really beautiful. Everybody was really loving this one. So this part comes out, and you could just wear this as a as a brooch if you wish. Nice. Really pretty shell cameo. Yes. And these are a mother of pearl beads. So let's put it on our neck. I'll show you how it's meant to be worn like this. I didn't really like straighten it out very well, but um, I love this. Do you love this, Mom? Yes. This is so it's kind of high fashion and it would also really be a conversation piece too because it's she's beautiful it's just so it's so different you know and if you didn't want to wear this here obviously just throw that right in the back and cover it up with your hair so it's kind of like <laughs> two necklaces in one and a brooch which you can take off of there and wear separate so this one is forty dollars and what is the drop on this one mom what do we just say nine inch about nine inches or so yeah nine inch drop not length you know this is a kind of an exquisite antique victorian ornament and that's not a um i don't know what that is i guess it is just a little bit of a scratch it's not a crack i just want to point that out this is beautiful this is so beautiful now, what makes this really interesting is that it has this paperwork. Grandma Bellows, I don't know what I don't know what the name is. Uh, uh, mother gave her this when she left Canada to live in the USA in the year of 1889. So I paid a lot of money for this. Um, I paid a real, real lot of money for this. But if anybody's interested, I'll just put this out here. Uh, this one would be 225 in case anybody had to have it. And it could also be worn, be worn as a pendant, as far as I'm concerned. But this is really special. Beautiful die cut in there and a little bit of um, brocade kind of stuff right there going around the side. Oh, it's just so concave lovely. Yes. yes, the concave glass. Yes, yes. It's so beautiful. 
I love this little Christmas pin. My lights, it's like, let me try to hold it up more so you can see these are nice colors. There it goes. Yeah, now you can, it's sort of brightening up. But look at it from the side. This is great. I love old Christmas brooches. And what's kind of cool about this one is it, <laughs> it like stands sort of. Well, not really, but <laughs> sort of, you know, like a tree would. It has its its Christmas tree stand. Really adorable vintage gold tone and uh, colored rhinestone Christmas pin. This is $20. Here's another really cute Christmas pin with, with nice colored orna ornaments. Prong set stones. And this one is signed Brooks. It's in nice condition. Uh, this Christmas tree pin is $12. Here's a pair of beautiful earrings. I don't know what kind of stone. I mean, I was thinking this is probably chrysoprase. I'm not sure, um, but they are sterling. They're heavy. They're detailed and gorgeous and ornate. I love these dangle earrings. Aren't they beautiful? In nice condition. These are $32. I love this bracelet. This is about eight inches long. Let's see how many strands. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, right? Yeah, nine strands. This is new with a tag. It's a Monet. It was $58 in the day. But look at the, the clasp here. Really beautiful. Rhinestones on both. And it goes in like this, right? And then you have the, your two little safety, safety things. Hmm. I think this is really, really Lovely. beautiful. Yeah, I, I love it too. I really love it. And that just says Monet right there. It's really a beautiful item. New Monet. And this is $32. That's it for this time, everybody. We'd like to thank you so much for joining us. Right, Mom? Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, you guys know what to do. Uh, PayPal only. And you need to send me an email. I am the funky pickle at gmail.com. You know, with your information, your address, uh, your name, your YouTube name, and all of that stuff. All right, $5 shipping in the U.S. It's more if you're in another country. And that's it for now. Stay tuned. We're going to be doing another sales video and some hauls and auction things and all kinds of stuff. So thanks again for joining us, everybody. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.